Good day. I'm here to speak with you to update you on the H1N1 virus's impact on fall influenza and immunization activities. We are expecting ample supplies of vaccine, or maybe not. I don't know. Uh, anyway, uh, we think that there will be enough of arriving eventually. Uh, well, we're, we're not expecting any shortages. Well, we, we will have some shortages uh, in the first couple of months when the disease is expected to be at its most severe. Oh, who am I kidding? We're all doomed. There's no way we can vaccinate everybody. But let me get a hold of myself. Hang on. <clears throat> Okay, we will be giving the vaccine to uh, pregnant women first because they are at greatest risk. Uh, and then whoever can push their way to the front of the line. I mean, wait a minute, that's not right. Uh, whoever, uh, according to special protocols of those at risk, such as uh, healthcare workers, healthcare workers. That's right, healthcare workers. I am a healthcare worker. So I, I should get the vaccine first uh, so that I can care for you all who won't have the vaccine and will be dying hideous, horrible deaths. Oh no, we're so doomed. We're so doomed. Hang on. <clears throat> okay, um, we are expecting the virus to be coming back with seasonal influenza viruses, we are expecting more children and fewer elderly people to be involved. That's right. I think it's important to review about influenza and preventing the spread of influenza. This will be an FDA-approved vaccine, and we are expecting it to be safe. And we are marshalling the full force of the government behind this effort, and we are very proud to say that 20% of the vaccine is being produced in this country, and we are going to probably need about 60% of the vaccine, which means that uh, other countries won't be able to have those. Those would be kind of lesser important countries. Anyway, it's important to note that this has really not been a very serious infection. It's really been primarily not much worse than the average cold, unless it mutates, in which case it could be coming a ravaging death. <clears throat> we will be providing updates about this as information becomes available. Please visit our website at www.wearesodoomed.com. Uh, no, that's not the website. Wait a minute, who put that in there? This is a very important vaccine and a very important program, and we thank you for your cooperation. Thank you.